Here I am at Harad Oriental, and it's my day to look at Afghan, uh, not Afghan, it's my day to look at antique Kaleems. This is just a really nice example of type. This is a Karabaugh Kaleem. Um, and quite frankly, either you love them or you hate them. Um, it's, a, it's a floral spray. It's a huge floral spray set on a dark background. You know, one of the things is, is they started making these this is very much in the Russian era, and this would have been made 100 years ago for the Russian market. Tsarist Russia, this would have been an extremely attractive piece to be sold in Moscow or St. Petersburg or any number of other cities across Russia. What happened was the Tsars came in, they took the Caucasus from Persia. They um, drove out many of the Muslims, not all of them, many of them stayed. We, we know them as Azeri today. But they also started bringing in many, um, many Armenians. Um, I suspect that these rugs were probably made by Armenians, uh, transplanted in, who then were making rugs to be um, sent from this new province of Russia into, into the main area of Russia. Russia at that point um, was heavily influenced by the French. Peter the Great had brought in many French engineers, architects, officers. Um, so the French style was then interpreted to Russian taste. And here we have Armenian weavers in the Caucasus, in Karabakh, weaving to the Russian-French taste of, say, 1890-1900. Fun piece. Like I said, you either love them or hate them. This is a great example for, uh, for its type.